I don't know if I'll be able to get guns on though. I don't get much ammo, and I'm actually shockingly bad with the 20 mil, 23 mil. It doesn't matter, it's the missile kills that do it. Ooh, I nearly brought S24s, so that would have been a mistake. I should put it on. Yeah. Uh, so, lightning or phantom? Uh, whatever. Let's do the lightning first, because I know it's shit. I know it has no chance. I wouldn't really expect the lightning to have much chance. Not really. Holy god, this thing turns around like it's just made out of fucking bullshit. Mm-hmm. It's two tons too light anyway. Uh, let's see what we can do here. Oh, didn't even bother fucking engaging in that bullshit. Fox. Oh, shit. Oh my god. Oy, that was that so was... close. Yeah, that that was... little swing at the end saved it. <laughs> little booty swing at the end. Man, the, this thing has so much instantaneous pull, it's actually ridiculous. Mm -hmm. And it's not even buffering, like buffer enemy bar or anything. Apparently delta wings are... Uh... Oh jeez. Just one thing I can fuck with you on, the roll rate. Only just. Yeah. Still, it's a nice, nasty roll for a big plane. on the wing. Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Wow, well, it sounded like you literally overshot me. So I've just done a stupid there. Uh, yeah, literally the sound told me that you'd overshot. So if I was mess up now, you'd be absolutely fucked. Uh, you really? Yeah. Yeah, possibly dodge that. If I timed the launch right, you'd have had no chance. Fair enough. Oh, jeez. Ah, oh, fuck, I was not paying too much. I thought I could just yank back on the stick and save it. Didn't work like that. Are you just running away? No, no, not at all. Fox. Yeah, not bothered. It's not good. Feel much safer doing these kind of moves now because. Fox. Flares allow us to just shrug off the gun the missiles. For the most part. I can see you again. No, you cl catching me right now? Yeah. 
No, that's mad. That shouldn't be happening. <laughs> it's only because I'm cutting into your turns. I didn't dive down as low, so you like added a big corner bit that you didn't need, if that makes any sense. Mm-hmm. It was more for the energy man uh, energy regain. So you only just went subs. Alright, I'll work it like this then. I'll try it this way. Come on. Man, if I could aim this gun I'd have probably killed you like eighty times. <laughs> I just don't I don't I don't I don't know what the lead is, so I'm just being super conservative and wanting to get to within like four hundred meters. Does it not have a gun sight? Yeah, but it's fucking terrible. I never ever trust the gyros. They're just awful. <laughs> you have to be in the same like, like you have to match the turn for it to work. Like right now it's telling me to lead like I don't know, 8 feet when you're nearly 2 kilometers away. There's just no way it's going to ever be accurate. Oh yeah, there's within some some parameters, within, like, within limited parameters they Yeah, but like the whole point of this fucking radio, you know, like you lock them with radar, it's supposed to adjust the range accordingly, that's like the whole point of it. Yeah, but only within a certain range, like within maybe 2,000 yards or something like that. It doesn't work out for all ranges and all eventualities. It's like a limited analog computer. At least in these aircraft, it would have been. Oh, am I getting away at all? The Mac 1.2. No, I'm closing in like rapidly. Oh, if I can, let's just do the, the classic reversal then. Yeah, so I mean, the SMTs, if it's under 6, you can't do anything about it. No, oh, I know what I can do. How are you so slow? Uh, because we're 8,000 fucking meters. No, but I'm like, I'm having to like throttle off to not overshoot. What, on Mac 1.3? Yeah. You have to throttle down. I've used more than half of my ammo. Oh fuck, I'm gonna rip. Yep. That's what the missiles are for though, isn't it? Fox. Oh my god, that was close. Okay, you got one left. Yeah. Well, no, I'm d currently doing a speed you cannot maintain, so... Fuck off your radar. I've had you locked up, like, almost this entire fight. <laughs> yeah, it goes like, whoop, whoop, beep, 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 beep. Different times. Alright, let's see. You. Oh, whoops. Oh, come on. Okay, it didn't take my speed, cool. Right, yeah, am I gonna get caught in a circle here? Yeah, I'm gonna try and get some separation after I respawn. So I don't get thingied back in. Uh, okay, no, no, it did me properly that time. <laughs> Sweet, nice one. Every time you drop flares, I'll I pass them and then think someone's fire fucking myself at me. <laughs> Some fucking retard during the game. What? 
Yes, yeah, so I'm gonna join. Put the pots on. He's not. He Seriously, go see what Venus. Better she be done quick then. Whoa, baby. I should have done this ages ago. <laughs> uh... Mental, 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 mental. Is that an actual spin that you're gonna put me in just like that? Wow, that's unbelievable. Yeah, that's what. This thing spins for any reason. Yeah, that's what happened to me. Yeah, the SMT is not competition for anything. No, you're not gonna have much. Yeah. It's the the, the, yeah. the, the gun just lets it down. Like if if you hadn't. Um, I should have got something that can beat it. If I hadn't been telling you when I was firing missiles. Then I think mm. that yeah, I probably would have killed you because like two of them got really fucking close, even with you knowing. Bear in mind, this is a level or two G tolerance. What? Well, what do you mean? But the the guy, the crew I'm using is level two G tolerance. Oh, right, okay. But the airframe itself, I believe. I don't know what whether to play it and like trying to stay behind you, like really slow speed, or just go for separation. Do do a bit of everything. I think the SMT can always separate. Almost any. You always gotta think about blind spot and fox twos and stuff like that. Hey folks, some uh, post commentary analysis for you now. So the SMT, um, just in summary, it's I think it's very reliant on its missiles because the gun is exceedingly hard to use. If you practice like fuck and get super good with the gun, this is probably the best jet in the game because right now. The only things that are a problem for it in, a, in an actual game scenario are the phantoms that have flares because they have flares. It can stick with everything else and obviously in this scenario when I'm fine with Dave we're like trying to turn fight which isn't how you're meant to use the MiG-21. If there were other things going on and I could separate and get a teammate to distract the YS then it would have no chance whatsoever I could sneak back around and get a missile kill. No problem whatsoever. This is probably the only thing in the rough vicinity tier of this plane that can turn with it, accelerate with it at low speeds at least, um, and stay close enough to it that it can't turn around inside and get guns on before the wires can close the gap and get inside its turn circle. Everything else you either out speed, out climb, or out turn because the MiG 21's instantaneous turn rate is just disgusting. Like it can just hit crazy high levels of AOA um, and it just power slides through the air, which lets it get the nose on even when it's not actually flying out of target. Oh, there you are. Really? <laughs> Surprising. Lol, couldn't pick that up. Foxy two. Oh, there's no even an attempt it. I've just lost you. There you are. Oh, how did you go through my gun sight and not die? Nothing goes through my gun sight. No one flaunts my gun sight. Oh, that was spicy. Cue the Kenny Loggins. Got caught in, caught in a bit of a slipstream there. Bit of a slipstream, like a stall stream. I was a bit. Flying like a bit of a shitter. Right, what are we working with here? Fox. No, it's not what not let me have it.
Wrong maneuver. Way. Right maneuver. No, trust it, trust it, trust it. Oh trust my it. god, as if, if you. No way. Yes, trust it. Trust in the Gino, but then he immediately turns the wrong way. Not a problem. Oh, baby. A triple. Oh, you're so lucky. <laughs> All skillful, one or the other. All broken in for what? Oh, <laughs> <laughs> nearly, nearly. Get out of here with that delta wing high angle of attack. Bullshit. Because now look at you out of energy and out of ideas. What? Fuck off. My, my guns are just ineffective against your stealth armor. So my girl is making a whole lot of noise. Oh. Got you. Hey. Fuck me, man. <laughs> are you dead? Mm, almost definitely. I don't know. I just managed to save it. Fox, if I can get the fucking shot. No. Fox. Oh, what? Oh, I got you. Yes! Missile's OP. To be fair. I think you'd have eventually won that, because my, uh, my entire like, center fuselage is fucked. Minimum. I think um, there were like two or three times when it, you, I went in front of your nose, but the, the guns just didn't hit didn't, for whatever reason. Yeah. Like, you'd have definitely <laughs> got me then. But <laughs> like three occasions of it will happen. But it's, it's, so, it's, just, it's beyond ridiculous that this, this thing is able to maneuver that well. Mm -hmm. Yeah, like some of the moves it does are just like what you want. But also at the same time I'm kinda of surprised this thing maneuvers how it does. It's like round about the same weight and you got like a lot more thrust and it still just, just matches it in a lot of ways. Or six giveaway. A bit bamboozled. Ah, oh, there you are. Hmm. Not drawing in the vertical scissors with me now. Oh, yep, yeah, maybe you won't. Wait, what? Oh fuck, I fluffed that. No, wing stall. Advanced stall maneuvers for dummies. I need that book. I did the wrong, I did the boo boo, I did the boo boo, I fucking idiot. <laughs> I'd have ended up on your six if you carried through anyway. Okay, yeah. So, anyway, as I was saying, um, the lightning, it can out turn, it can out everything. 
missiles will kill the lightning easily. The F, the, the F4C, set in duck for the same sort of reasons. The FGR, I think, can maneuver well enough to fly defensive, and the flares negate the missiles. So you need the gun to effectively kill an FGR, or you need to catch it unawares, which means don't lock on with radar because it has RWR, so it will know. Um, the only things I think might stand a chance are the new Phantoms that have better missiles and the leading edge slats to help it manoeuvre, but I have yet to test that. I think that might be the only thing that gets close enough to do anything. Did you see Did you see the shells coming past you? Almost, yeah. I, I heard them. How do you still have the energy to do that? Like, what the fuck? Yeah, I know. It's a, it's a, it's a, yeah, there we go. You, t so you turned lead them, so right? fucking quickly and just carried on going the same speed. <laughs> it reminds me of like the yaks down at the low, low tiers. God, the fucking blackout thing is just pissing me off. Man, I've lost track of you against the ground. I hear you. I see you though. There we go. Alright, I've, I've lost you completely. Nah, how did I fluff that so badly? I have absolutely no idea where that you are. Fuck. Nah, I'm fine. Yeah. Separation. I'm separate. right in front, in front, right in front of you. No, I was like, I thought I got really unlucky. Separation time out. Fox. Oh, can I get it in that turn? I don't even see. Two. Fox, two. You're dead. Nope, you're not dead. But I'm getting closer, and these aliens don't lie. Fox, two. Oh, that was close. <laughs> Every time you maneuver, oh wow, you're not hanging around for very long down there, surely. Guns, guns, guns. Oh, that was close. That was a hit, wasn't it? Yeah, redded my left aileron. It looked awesome against the sea. How are you still with me? Gone pretty fast. I'm gaining speed in this climb. That's something that's not happening for me. Oh, I jerked that one a bit too hard and scrubbed speed I shouldn't have. And here we are, up at 7,000 meters. How are you still? What, what the fuck? I thought you'd have like, stalled before I even turned around. Yeah, it always seems like that. Whatever is the case. <laughs> I feel like you're going to have gained enough from that dive to have just come straight back up at me, so I'm going to have to dive as well. I feel like we couldn't have merged at any better speed for me. And any worse a speed for you. I did not lose a kilometer an hour in that turn. I feel like you actually performed better at high altitude, which makes very little sense. The engines are markedly not really any different, but the engines definitely not doing their thing up there. Yeah, I can't go above Mach 1. It's like a hard limit the G91YS has. It will never exceed Mach 1 in any situation. Oh, you're fucking dead, dude. Yeah, that's not the one. That's the no bueno for you. Guns, guns, guns. Oh, wait, wait. Let's fucking have those pop gun style merges. Ooh. 
Okay, that was a bad move on my part. What, not that didn't fucking kill you? Oh, come off it. What? <laughs> Alright, I'm just gonna do solid fucking two second bursts now. Okay, now this is fucking impossible. Concentration is real. Just leave me alone, please. Oh my god, if I, had, I wish I could aim this gun. Alright, so this is the last fight of the match now. Or the video, I should say, I guess. Um, so the the general vibe of these dogfight videos is that I want to try and get a sort of... Not a database, but I want these videos to act as like a, a source that you can come and use to, to judge an effectiveness of an aircraft versus the other things that it might see. So things that are a genuine threat to you and things that you can easily handle without having to worry about, things like that. So we're talking what instantaneous turn rates, sustained turn rates, um, climb rates, acceleration, that kind of thing, and comparing them comparing them against each no other. And it's run the fuck away time. No way you're close enough to shoot me. How's your ammo? 50, 52 <laughs> rounds left. I've got 68. I can't see you though. Not even in my shit mirror. Oh wait, actually maybe I can. Fuck off my card. So the summary from this video would be that the G91 is actually quite a significant threat to the MiG-21, at least if you get slow because it can accelerate with you, it can climb with you, it has better visibility than you, at least in the frontal quarter, um, and it can, it's a sustained turn rate is much better. I'm going to retry this, the 6 o'clock quarter is not, for, I cannot chase you for long there. The MiG-21 versus the G-91, the, the fighting styles are totally different when it comes to dogfighting. The G-91 can maintain a turn and hold speed without losing it for way longer so if you oh were just going to run close. in circles around each other the G91 would eventually get behind you because the MiG-21 would bleed too much speed but the MiG-21 has a much higher instantaneous turn speed which is why right now because I can't turn with him I can't sustain this turn I'm going high so that on the downward bit right now gravity helps me pull my nose around quicker otherwise I wouldn't have been able to follow him through that maneuver I'd have ended up in lag pursuit way behind and it's also worth noting that there's been multiple instances in this video um, where if I'd just used missiles the fight would have been over way sooner but that's not what we're trying to do here. The missiles are very much just a last resort. The reason that we're carrying them at all is just because the weight makes the plane performance more realistic. Even though we're using minimum fuel and an infinite fuel as well in case you haven't noticed. But um, we're just trying to standardise it and make it a bit more repeatable if we do this again um, so yeah if you uh, if you like what we've done here and you want to see more then let me know of other lineup suggestions someone earlier um, said the cougar and the javelin um, I think the super mystere and the javelin might be a good one um, the etendard which I don't have yet but I imagine that might be a good matchup for maybe a hunter f1 or I, I honestly I don't know you'll have to uh, throw me your suggestions but if the outcome is too obvious, then I'm not going to do it. Or if, if me and Dave practice it and it's like always one plane winning, then I'm probably not going to do a video on it. Um, but we'll play it by ear. We might even do another one like this. I hate you. Where um, we have multiple things fighting the same plane in one video, but I don't know. I, I just quite want to keep this going. Did I hit you then? So let me know in the comments. Nah, no hits yet. This one's gonna be one there. Oh no. I've got no ammo left. It does reload. Yeah, it reloads. Oh, come on, mate. No, I'm dead. That was my kind of Hail Mary. Take a shot. Alright, so G91 and SMT are pretty evenly matched in the turn fight. Surprisingly. Yeah.
That makes very, <laughs> very little sense. Hey, folks, so uh, round up the video at the end here. Uh, thanks a lot for watching if you saw it all the way to the end. Um, just two things to mention before I go. Uh, first of all, uh, the other day me and Dave flew some pretty epic formation shit with the Lightnings in an EXE match. My ping was too high for us to really get into combat, um, and it was just a, not not a good day for, for trying to kill shit, so we just sort of flew around, and uh, unfortunately the the ping made it the video horrible, like there's jiggly bollocks everywhere, and it just didn't look great, but I did take a metric fuckton of uh, pretty badass screenshots, so if you want to flick through these at your leisure, or use them for I don't know, wallpapers or whatever, because there are some that don't have the markers on, then uh, feel free to go and have a look, like this one here. Although it does showcase a bug which I found where the cockpit is like open a tiny bit, which is fucking weird. Look at that. But anyway, yeah, um, and the other thing is that I want to show you that we are now affiliated with Air Models. So if you fancy buying some models, there's diecast or resin, there's like 300 different choices, there's military and civilian, blah, blah, blah. Use my link in the description and you will help the channel out. Just wanted to say that. If you watch to the end, then I appreciate you doing that. So I feel like you'd appreciate me making you aware of channel -y good relatedness. And I'm just trying to upsell some shit, basically, because uh, I don't know. I don't, I don't really try and uh, get much out of this. And I don't try and brand myself or get myself out there very much. I'm quite happy to just be the, the niche guy in the background. But um, I don't know. I just I feel like because this company approached me and said, do you want to be an affiliate, that I should try and actually make, make people where I am and hopefully actually help them get some business because I assume that's why they approached me. But uh, but yeah, so thanks a lot for watching again, um, and I will see you in the next one. Cheers.